Angel to create media and manage your media is actually quite simple. It's a very robust learning management system. Um, I've gone ahead and just gone into the lesson section, but I could go into resources or the course itself and set it up this way. And I can add content by just by clicking on Add Content. When I do that, I get to a menu where you can see I have lots of choices. I can create a folder, so I can create a folder for Lesson 1, for example. And then create a folder for each lesson or module. And now I'm in the Lesson 1 folder. Again, I can add content. I can create a web page, a link to a URL, a survey or form. I can upload files. Here's where I'm going to upload some media. I can create a Dropbox for students to submit assignments. I can create a game. So here's some more media. I can create a game like a crossword puzzle or a quiz show. I can create a discussion forum, add a blog, add a wiki. Um, create an RSS feed from this from this uh, page. Create an assessment, either a practice test or an exam. Or create an inline section heading. I can also, once I set up a course, I can copy items to create a duplicate item. So if I lesson one and lesson two are pretty much the same except for a few things, I can just copy items. I can add content from Merlot, which is a learning object repository. Um, which was which is fantastic. Lots of resources, so I can add content there, or I can add from predefined templates. So I can copy items from one course to another, from one course within the course, um, and so on and so forth. I'm going to go ahead and show you what a typical media file would look like. I'm going to add a file. I'm going to add a movie. So it's very easy. A quick file. I'm going to find a movie. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go ahead and open up one of these. I'm going to title it and upload the file. Depending on the size of the movie, it may take a few minutes. Once the file has been uploaded, it will tell you so. I'll click OK, and there it is under Lesson 1. So again, now if I go to Lessons, click on the Lesson 1 folder, I'll find all of the information that I want from Lesson 1, whatever it is that I have uploaded. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the media file, and it'll play right in the, um, the shell. And there we go. <laughs> I can also create um, Word documents or, like I said, web pages and things for content. But this is specifically how you manage media in Angel. And again, it's very easy to do, very easy to set up. They have lots of options for you. It's one of my favorite learning management systems, personally.